Hello, today we're going to walk through installing Java 7 on Mac OS 10.9. So the first thing uh, we want to do is we want to open up the terminal. Let's type in terminal. Now if we type java-version, we'll see that Mac OS X 10.9 comes with Java 1.6. Now interestingly enough, on my system, um, if I go to my system preferences, go to Java, if you hit update, it says I have Java 7 update 60. However, this I believe is only for, um, I'm not exactly sure what that's for, but it does not uh, list Java on as an option on the command line. So the way we want to in install Java to make it work uh, from a command prompt as well, first we'll go to what we're going to do is we're going to actually download the SDK. So even though uh, we're not developers, I uh, just want to run some Java code that requires Java 7. The S when you install the SDK, it sets up um, the command line to work correctly for Mac OS X 10.9. So we'll go to java.com slash JDK. We'll come down here and say go to JDK Downloads. We'll skip uh, right. I don't want Java 8, uh, so I'm going to scroll past Java 8 and go to Java 7. So the latest 7 and click JDK download. All right, we have to accept their license agreement. And then we see Mac OS X X 64 bit and click the download link here. All right, that, while that's downloading, we'll skip ahead to when that's finished. All right, so now that Java is downloaded, we will uh, double click on the downloaded file. This is going to open the uh, DMG file, uh, which is a Mac OS ins installation package. We'll double click again on the package, and we have the installation wizard here. We'll go continue, install. All right, we can close that. <clears throat> we'll open up Finder here. We'll eject the JDK installation package so it's no longer mounted there. Uh, we can close that. <clears throat> now we'll open up the uh, the terminal again. Uh, just go to Terminal. Now when I type Java-version, I get Java version 1.7060. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, so now I can uh, just from the command line, I have the capability of running applications that require Java 1.7. Uh, one other uh, bit of troubleshooting that you can do, if it's still not working for you, is you can use this um, command Java underscore home. So you have to use the full path to utilize it. It's user slash user slash lib exec Java underscore home. If you do dash capital V, this will list every Java that is um, available on the machine. So if you if you have a if you still require an application that you need Java 1.6, you can actually run the command export Java underscore home equals. You use a back tick, and you can do user lib exec Java underscore home, and you can specify what version of Java you want to use. So let's say. You want to use Java 1.6. Put 1.6 in there and finish with the back tick. Hit enter. Now I want to do Java dash version. We're running Java 1.6. If I want to switch back to Java 1.7, I can come back here and put a 1.7 in there and export the path for Java 1.7. And we type Java dash version. And now we're using Java 1.7 again. Um, so that's it. That's the easiest way to get uh, Java 7 installed on your Mac OS X 10.9 and also um, you know, have it work not only from you know, within browsers but also uh, from the command line. Thank you.